we have new information about sports at Southwest High School in Kansas City. Yesterday, the district's athletics director said there will be no fall sports at the school because of state rules. This morning, state officials tell us that is not true. Larry Seward broke this story. He's in the newsroom with the latest. Larry, good morning. Krista, good morning to you. A spokesman for Missouri's High School Activities Association told me this morning Southwest can absolutely field teams for all fall sports, including football. He says Kansas City School District officials know that and were told as much in January. However, any potential football team would not be eligible for state playoffs because the district officials did not file classification paperwork in time. Of course, the district was undergoing its right-sizing plan. Members of Westport City champion football team you see here hope to play at Southwest since Westport closed as part of the district's restructuring plan. Yesterday, Athletics Director Kimball Landers, seen here, told us Southwest students can't compete for their school or play at another school because of state rules. However, three Three former Westport players began practicing with Central High School because of this letter they received June 30th from Anders. In it, it says varsity sports will not be offered at SWEC this year. However, those eligible to play sports may participate at their neighborhood school. Today, this story took another turn for those three players. They were not allowed to practice at Central. The orders came from district officials. Uh, I was told that we couldn't practice with them. Um, I don't know why, but uh, they keep switching up, saying we can't play and then we can't play. So I don't know. It, it is. It's starting to, you know, get kind of irritating because we, we're ready to play football, obviously. Because if we didn't, we wouldn't show up to practice this morning. But it's, it's kind of tough, to, you know. We don't. We still don't know. And y'all, y'all sent us letters saying that we could, and now we show the practice that we can't play. So it's kind of, it's kind of difficult. It's difficult for their former coach who feels for his players. It's also an issue several school board members want resolved, and they want it resolved quickly before school starts. So they plan to discuss this issue during tonight's school board meeting at 630. We will have more details about that. There's much more on this story because we are doing a series of reports regarding the merger of Southwest and Westport. For more details, go to NBCActionNews.com and look under education. Live in the newsroom, Larry Seward, NBC Action News.